Hey guys, how are you today? I am jumping on really quick this afternoon. It's right at noon here on the 4th of July. And guys, I washed my hair and I realized that I had not done an update on my locks in quite some time. And I know I do have a few lock followers and viewers here on my channel. And I don't want you guys to think that I have forgotten all about you. I've just been busy and doing other things. And after you make that year mark, I think a lot of things is like kind of redundant for like the next six months. So I didn't want to just come back and just be showing you my head every month and there's actually no changes. So I washed it today, so I thought it would be a good time to do an update on it. So this is it shortly after I've washed it and just let you guys just get a really quick look at it. I have been fighting the buildup problem, uh, which a lot of it is my fault because I do use gel, um, the Eco Styler gel. I use the uh, black castor oil uh, around the front of my head when I'm sleeking my hair up in styles and so that contributes to it it's not really hard to get the build up at the front but when it gets in the back locks which are tend to be a little bit thicker sometimes it can be a struggle so i'm going to do a turnaround let you guys see it and this is right after i washed it and what the noticeable change i think i see is the growth i have my hair has grown quite a bit and whenever you wash your hair you get to see the true length of it because the weight of the water kind of holds your hair down before it shrinks and you get to see it so this is me uh, I am a little over 15 months. July the 25th, I'll be 16 months. So this is where I'm at. So I'm going to try to hopefully get in this camera so you can see it. And I have not had a retwist probably in about six to eight weeks. I've been trying to stretch out my retwist a little bit longer uh, just so that my hair will thicken and it's not damaging to my roots. And it actually just, you know, I don't know, it's just very healthy for your hair not to retwist it so much. So I'm going to turn around. You may see some buildup. I rinsed it out and I have not put my conditioner in it yet. I do spray up a conditioner or liquid conditioner in my hair, which is black vanilla. And um, I think I've shown you that product before, but just let you guys get a look at where we are here. A little over 15 months. So I am really happy with the progress. I have not had any issues. I did have um, about a month ago some trouble with dryness in the back at my nape. I'm not sure. I used to wear a silk scarf that I would not back here. And I don't know if that was irritating it or not, but I stopped doing that. And actually some nights I don't sleep with anything on my head. I actually sleep on a silk pillowcase. So sometimes I just let my locks be free and it has not been any harm done to it. No damaging, you know, effects or anything like that. So it's just a preference. I think whether you want to wear a bonnet tied down, it's hot. So a lot of times I don't want to have that on my head either. So, but yeah, guys, this is a little over 15 months. My ends still have not completely sealed. You know, that's the curlier part of my hair. So, you know, that could take a while. Some people lock really quick on the ends and some people don't. Look at that. <laughs> Still curly, curly, cool on the end. But it is sealed except for the new growth that comes in. So, yeah, it's locked. See how the water on me is still dripping a little bit. But I just wanted to come on really quick and give you an update on it. Um... Don't know when I'll be back for another update. Maybe since this is 15 months, maybe I'll do another one in about two to three months and basically kind of let you see the growth of it. I just figured that the less I manipulate my hair now days and, you know, I don't do a lot of styles. Basically, the only style that I really do is I'll pull all my hair right up here in the front and allow these to hang down in the back pretty much. And usually I have those two hanging here or either sometimes I'll put them up as well. But I don't do a lot of manipulation to my hair. I just want it to actually mature and, you know, grow and be healthy. And, you know, I hear a lot of problems people are having with their hair. Other than, I think after your 12 months, I think the biggest problems will be like drying. 
because hydration is important, especially in these summer months when it's real humid. You know, guys, that water got to be in there. So I pretty much put water in my hair every single day. You know, I spritz my hair every day. It has a little oil mix mixture in it, and I kind of just spritz it in the morning. And uh, drying and, yeah, the dry hair and dry scalp. Those are uh, two things I think that you might deal with after the year. And the other one, like I said, was um, build up. If you're not using any product in your hair, I don't think you'll have that issue yeah, you can get the smog and stuff from outside in your hair or clothing that might have lint, you know, fibers or some that come out of the clothing or where you lay your head at night. If you land on a spread that has fibers that, you know, come up. But other than that, if you're not doing and putting in a whole lot of different products in your hair, I don't think you'll have the buildup issue. So, yeah, but I'm going to get over it. I'm not going to do all the little clay mask and stuff. I've been using that product that I brought to you in the last one that with the apple cider. And I think it helps. And I'll just keep applying that. And then, like I said, as time go on, I won't be using the gel because my hair is actually getting to a point where I think I'll be able to wear it down. I'm still not wearing it all down yet. I don't know why. It's paranoia, I think. I just think it doesn't have a professional appeal to it. But I may start maybe just, you know, putting a piece up on the side like that and then wearing one side down at some point. <laughs> don't know when, but at some point. But that's it, guys. Just wanted to bring you a quick update on the locks. Thank you for sticking with me, my lock followers, guys. I love my journey. Um, those first few months, I think from one to six months, were a little rough for me. But after I got past the six month, I think it started kind of getting, you know, comfortable. And I was getting uh, used to them and loving them and everything. I think everybody's journey is different. So that's just my my feelings. That's how I felt about mine. But I'm loving it. Not going to change it. Going to stick with it. I am thinking about putting color. I meant to mention that to you guys. I'm not sure right now if I want to do a red, like a burgundy red type color or dip my ends and with a, like a blonde or bronze color. I was going to put like a rinse on my roots to cover some of the gray, but dip my ends in there. But a lot of people tell me that the blonde can be damaging and drying to your hair. So I'm going to think on that before I do it. But at some point, you guys will see some color. So that's it. So take care, guys. I hope you have a fantastic day. And if you're celebrating this holiday, I hope you have a safe one. I got some other videos coming up to you guys. I'm about to go on my vacation. Well, I'm on vacation today, but taking a trip on tomorrow. So you'll be seeing some vlogs also after this. So take care, guys. Love you much. Peace and love. Bye.